Hello everybody, I'm Jasper from Yabos Creations. Welcome back to my channel. Today is gonna be another voiceover acrylic pouring video. If you like this type of video, then please let me know in the comments down below. In preparation for this video, I created some mixtures of paint. I made these by adding some paint thinner called fruit roll in a cup. Then I added about the same amount of acrylic paint. Next up you mix it, then you check the consistency. Usually you will need to add water a couple of times and keep on mixing until you reach the desired consistency. If you want to see a full video explaining the entire process of how I learned how to perform acrylic pourings, then you can check out the video I made that will be in the description down below as well as linked somewhere at top. As you've been able to see so far, I've been using these pre-mixed colors by layering them layer for layer carefully in a beaker. And then when I have enough layers, I will add some silicone. The silicone droplets will help to increase cell formation. And then it's time to flip the cup and I will stop babbling for a bit and let you enjoy the magical effect of pouring art. I've reached the final stage of this painting, which is adding some heat. I'm using a small food burner for this. One of those you can also use to make things like creme brulee. With the flame of this burner, I'm moving over the painting pretty quickly. Not too close because you don't want to actually burn it, but not too far away because we do want to actually have the effect of heat. It's one of those things you just have to experiment and get a feel for. The effect of the added heat is that you will increase the amount of cell formation and can also influence where the cells show up. So I'm kind of checking the composition, what I like, what I don't like and just experimenting to see where more cells pop up. Again, it's one of those things you just have to uh, build up your experience level with to understand how it actually affects the art piece. And here is the final result after the painting had about two weeks to dry because acrylic pouring art does take quite a while to dry. If you like this work then please like this video and let me know do you like these voiceover videos or would you prefer a video with no talking, just some chill music so that you can watch the process of painting in peace. If you like my work then of course please support me by liking my work, subscribing, sharing, all that good stuff and Above all, watch more of my videos on one of my various playlists. But that's it for now. I wish you all a wonderful day and hope to see you in the next video.